Now this we can't do with most calculators. Some people with 83 pluses and 84 pluses uh, have an app that will graph a line that has only X's in it, but this one won't. So I'm just going to make it go away, and I'm going to do this on paper. Okay. You can do it right here. X plus 6 equals 0. Now we can pick an X and a Y table. Choose any numbers you want for X. Actually, you can't do that, can you? Choose any numbers such that you can add it to 6 and you'll get 0. There's only one number, negative 6. Negative 6 plus 6 is 0, and there really is no other number you can choose and have a true answer there. But as it so happens, this is the line, if you were to subtract 6 from both sides, this is the line x equals negative 6. And what that says is that x has got to be negative 6 no matter what and you can choose any old numbers you want. Negative 5,000, oh my goodness. You can choose any old numbers you want for y. x is going to be negative 6. So the easy way to do this is to get a graph. Find x equals negative 6. It's right here, OK? So let's get the graph line. Choose x equals negative 6 and go click, and then go up three or four units, or down three or four units. Save your graph, check answer, perfectly done. Okay, you've learned how to graph. See you later.